Hi everyone, this is Carlo and me and welcome to this video. In this video, I'm here with my adorable pyjamas wearing a uh, little husky, Aura. And she's just such an adorable little girl in her pink pyjamas. Actually, she has a hood because she still has her tag here. And soon will be about one year she is here. The part of her I like the most is actually her tail. She is so adorable looking and so charming. And her tail is just so well finished. And I really appreciate that detail on her. Now, I would like to show you even more details in this video. <laughs> because I would like to show you the stuff that I have been finding in the mall that we have been visiting today. It's kind of a new mall. And, uh, well, like usual, there's, there isn't that much interesting except from clothes everywhere. But I was still able to find some nice interesting stuff uh, to use and to show. So first of all, I would like to show Katie some Hello Kitties that I found after our visit. Um, now I'm going to make a video for you to show you what will be in your package. So you have an idea what to expect. Um, now I'm going to show you these three girls. Here they are. Now I found even more for you, but I will wait till the next video. One of the next videos in which I'll show you the content of your package. Now I found these three girls because I thought you didn't have them yet and they were they are wearing some kind of a very colorful little dresses little little tutus this is a little purple girl we have a pink girl and she wears the same dress and this Christmas looking girl there you go looks like they were, these were kind of new and because of the Santa Claus actions, they were off price, so they were really good bargains. So I really hope you will enjoy them. Now one of the very first shops that I went to visit was Media Mart. Because I wanted to find the Star Wars Rebels Season 2 DVDs. And the Media Mart, where I used to go, will close down soon. So I don't really expect them to have what I'm looking for. But I was kind of lucky because by now also here Star Wars Rebel Season 2 must be out. And uh, I thought of that and I wanted to have a look in Media Markt. And yes, I was just so lucky. <laughs> so they helped me to find this DVD and I was so happy I finally found it. Because I didn't know where to look for it. Um, also I have to reach the places to go there. But when I found this I also found... Um, some other stuff that wasn't actually I wasn't really looking for that stuff but it was a very good thing to find it anyway um, now first of all I found this adorable BB-8 plush <laughs> they don't really used to have plush there in general uh, but I guess this guy must be a left out little one from an assortment that I actually never saw before so I was very interested of course He's the one who makes pretty weird noise noises. It doesn't actually sound like BB-8 to me. So he made kind of weird sounds. But he's like my little keychain and I was happy to find a little plush of him. Also because I liked a little red um, uh, spot here in, in its eye. This is my the only BB-8 that actually has this, my plush. So, And actually he has a huge uh, heart tag in which batteries are explained and also the ones available. So I don't really know if they had more of these but I think BB-8 was the only one left. Uh, except from another that I might show you soon. So I, I believe uh, these are the ones you could actually find, like Kylo and Rain, uh, Ray, sorry. Um, BB-8 that I have been collecting. There's a Stormtrooper, Yoda, Vader. I think I have Yoda as well. <laughs> and R2 and Chewbacca. So, well, I think this, this looks kind of like the underground uh, assortment. And I think my Yoda is right there. So, I was glad to find this BB-8. 
But I also found another one, a very funny one. You're gonna laugh seeing this. Whoops! <laughs> it's just rolling across the bed. What would it be? <laughs> Look! It's a plushy dead star. <laughs> it's just hilarious. And actually, I had the idea to hang him up on my ceiling. Because I have a few TIE Fighters and a Millennium Falcon flying there. And I have another little hook somewhere there. And um, if I hang him up, well, I will have some kind of um, Imperial ceiling. <laughs> so this was just such an adorable little item. And I already thought I would really enjoy a plushy Death Star. But I wasn't going to order one online because that looks kind of ridiculous. Anyway, I was really happy to find this one. This thing is hilarious. I'm pretty sure if I throw it to Kylie, she will even fetch it for me. She does so much for me, she would even fetch a dead star to me. So, <laughs> really, not, really nice item. So I was very surprised to find these. Especially because I never saw this assortment before in, uh, in Belgium. In foreign countries, yes, I did, but... And then I also found this um, Phasma pillow, but actually the reason I got it was because it was a huge Kylo on the back. <laughs> so, but I really like those characters, Phasma and Kylo, so, and I just love the merchandise picture of him. So, um, I really love this pillow, also because it really comes out of the, the pillow like this. It really looks scary and adorable and I love it, I love it, so I thought let's have this pillow as well. Um, I can really use it down there. So that's what I found in Media Marked. Now I also went to look for more books to read and to see if there were some nice books. Now there were lots of them, but I didn't get inspired by them all, of course. Um, so I got a few that I really would like to see and also a few that really inspired me. So, um, now first of all, I found this little one. So I got small books because I didn't feel like reading big ones. They're hard to take with me and, well, this is just one with The Force Awakens and actually all six episodes and it's about characters. So it's all French, couldn't find the Dutch ones. Um, but it's mostly about characters and vehicles and, well, actually it's meant to be, I think it's for young kids. But I like these books, I like the pictures and in each book I, I discover new pictures that weren't showed in my previous ones. So that's what I like about it. So this book will be pretty easy to finish. Um, and it's an adorable book. And then I got two covers. First of all, these were books that I wanted to find earlier, but I don't. I can't reach the, reach the shop where I could find them. First of all, there's the hero cover. Um, it contains two books. I think my nephew has those about the heroes, Jedi and Skywalker. Luke, I believe. I love the pictures. Also, I love the huge Star Wars pictures in there. I really love it. So... Also, there were some big encyclopedies. I'm pretty sure I will read them, but just not right now. This is the enemy book. So this talks about the enemies and it talks about the Sith and Darth Vader. So I'm pretty sure I will find the encyclopedies as well. Just not now. I don't really get the books. I don't feel like, like I'm gonna read. So I'm pretty sure soon I will. Well, I would like to finish Joe's first and I'm pretty sure maybe I'll just uh, read them again. I love it so much. Um, so yeah, these were the little books that I found. Now in the last part of this video, I would like to show you some stuff that I have been finding in one of my favorite groceries. A huge grocery actually, where they also sell a lot of non-food stuff. And in this period of the year, there's some kind of a Santa Claus action, uh, some kind of a special offer. And there's, well, there's a huge amount of toys in there in this period of the year. So that's why I like to visit uh, that shop. Also because they have lots of surprising stuff. Mostly the stuff that you can rarely find in other on other places. So, first of all, I would like to show you the two lightsabers that I found there. Now I found, I found two 
kind of vintage lightsabers. Now I used to collect all of them uh, when I see a few. Um, now these have some kind of a foam here on the on the blades. It's kind of squishy. It's really well made. And uh, well, they used to have lightsabers sometimes. It's not the first lightsaber that I got from there. And well, there's this pretty green one and this dark side red one. But for a while I stopped now drawing them, but I think I'll maybe one day I should start drawing them again and make them look nice on paper. So, well, yeah, I was really glad I found them. And also here you could get two pieces and get one free. Um, so I got something else as well. I like the pictures they put on this merchandise. I'm glad you can actually change the batteries. Um, but now this grocery is just, um, how would I say? They are in, uh, well, they are actually changing their uh, their look. So now it's a terrible mess in there. And I was almost kind of lost when I got in, so... Uh, well, I was still glad I could find my way to the toys. <laughs> so yeah, I found these two. Now, a while ago, Katie got me an adorable small little bunga plush. And I don't really know. Oh, I think there it is. I have a basket. If I'm right. Yes, with his turn on his belly. <laughs> And, uh, well, as I told you, I could get one toy for free. Of course, that was the one I actually paid because it was the most expensive one. But, so I got one of the sabers for free. Um, I found a bigger Banga one, a talking one. The ones that I actually could rarely find on other places. So, here he is. I wanted to collect Kion as well, but I was actually a bit... Um, I was counting the money, of course, so... Um, I got Banga as I really wanted to find the bigger one one day. Um, he's really adorable and so sweet. And he talks. Yeah! Ha! Yeah! Ha! He says a few phrases. He's really cute. At first place I thought it was a good idea to have him with me, but I'm not that sure. Actually I could have gotten something for my nephew as well instead of this guy um, I had a look in the Star Wars stuff to see if there were something else that could please me but I wasn't so sure about it and I agreed to get Banga but actually after all the idea it wasn't so good as well so I hope Banga would look really nice after I packed him out he's really adorable um, and I'm glad I found a bigger one Maybe I should have left him and got a little item for my nephew instead. So they were also a Kion, but as I said, I left him. Actually, I hoped to get them together, but it was just not possible this time, so... <laughs> so yeah. Well, still, this plush is really soft, good-looking and... He's, he's really good size, so I'm pretty sure he, I will like him anyway. Now I really hope you enjoyed this video. And I'll see you later guys. Thanks for watching. Bye!